Jury selection is underway in the third capital murder trial for Mauricio Torres. He's accused of killing his son. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker tells us when testimony could start. This is the third time the state and the defense has questioned potential jurors in the murder trial of Mauricio Torres. The first juror was seated yesterday and several more were seated today, but it's a process expected to last several days. Mauricio Torres is accused of killing his six-year-old son Isaiah in 2015. The Bella Vista man is accused of assaulting his son while on a family camping trip in Missouri. Isaiah died a day later as a result of his injuries. Torres' first trial was in 2016, where he was found guilty of capital murder and first-degree battery and sentenced to the death penalty. That conviction was eventually overturned by the Arkansas Supreme Court because they say the felony murder conviction is not valid because the injury that led to Isaiah's death happened in Missouri, not Arkansas. In 2020, Torres was convicted again, but a mistrial was declared after Torres' stepson tried to attack him in the courtroom. During both trials, Torres' other children said Isaiah was abused by their father countless times. Torres' wife, Kathy Torres, took a plea deal before her husband's first trial and testified against him, stating she never knew the extent of her son's injuries. She is serving life in prison without the possibility of parole. Court records show she's been moved from the Arkansas Department of Corrections to the Benton County Jail, where she'll stay until the trial is over. This third capital murder trial is expected to last around two weeks. We'll keep you posted on when testimony starts. Katherine Gilker, 5 News.